I'm gonna tell you guys what is keeping my kids occupied. The classics. You guys, Battleship is so good. Battleship. My kids have been loving Battleship. I don't know about you guys, but my kids, they just don't really play actual board games. And these classic ones have been keeping them so happy. And it's new. I know. Oh, you played a board game with Calvin? One time, we haven't seen them for three weeks. I'm gonna put a link for our favorite classic board games. Heaven bless Amazon, you guys, during this pandemic. Heaven bless the Amazon workers and delivery people. That's all I can say. Oh, I almost forgot. I wish I would have shown you guys this. Oops, while they were playing. This is the funniest little thing. You squeeze the Play-Doh through its neck so it has these like feathers and then it comes with a razor that you shave it off. <laughs> it's the cutest thing. Before I can do anything else, turn around, son. That has got to go. Because he will not stop staring at himself. <laughs> what were you doing when you were... <laughs> Look at mommy. Show me what you were doing when I was doing your hair. He kept smiling at himself. Okay, hot dog. Oh. I brought... Do you hear him? He's eating banana bread and he's like... <laughs> I brought up a bunch of my spring items that I want to decorate with and you cannot put these out without dusting them. If you want your house to feel better, smell better, look better, dust. I mean, dusting is the magic cure-all and I'm not even joking. There are a lot of things that we cannot control right now. The weather, it just plain sucks. This funk that we're in with staying home, do we be lazy and binge watch TV all day? Do we try and be productive? Do we utilize this time off that we have to just be? It's a weird in-between time. I'm kind of sick of this in-between situation that I cannot control. Same with my decorations. We're in this weird like time where it's not quite summer outside, but it definitely is not winter anymore. Screw it. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna take all of these in-betweeners and we're gonna put them away. And we're gonna bring out our spring. And that's just what we're gonna do. Cause I'm sick of this in-between. I need my spring back. So I need your guys' help. First and foremost, let's get these things put downstairs. So Olivia, I'm gonna have you go downstairs and find a spot where all of our games are for these new games. And I want you to make sure that all of the pieces for Battlestar, is that what it's called? We already put Battleship. We already put it away. Okay, perfect. Okay, go put those away. Cody, hop up. Okay, whoever's this belong to, I want you to go put that away. Boston, go hang the coat up. And the scissors, go take the scissors. Lincoln, I'm gonna have you Put all this away, because you're gonna go with Daddy to go get a ladder for me. You're gonna go to the new house with Daddy to get a ladder. Put this away. <laughs> now, Cody, here, Boston, I'll do it with you. Okay. 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 I changed my mind. This was over here last season and <laughs> and I never actually had anything finished here. I had like a little baby frame, but I've just never known what to put there. Guys, I'm literally the worst at decorating. I don't know how to put things together. Anyway, I have this over here. I will never take down our Hawaii picture. It's just my favorite. I love my seashells. Some of these were my great grandmas. Some of them we got on our trips, that kind of stuff. This is just very simple, what we've got on our mantle. And then I was thinking of, they have these skinny frames that are kind of the same color as this chair. 
that I think I want to put here. So I kind of want to get like a bigger frame just to lean against the mirror and then a smaller one. But I have to ask my interior decorator friend if that would be acceptable. So anyway, it's not a huge change, but it's a little more springy. It feels good to have like lighter colors out. Olivia, what would you think since Lady never sleeps up here if we put that downstairs in your room? Since she always sleeps downstairs. I think that'd be a good idea. Because Lady, she's like, I want to go in here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she knows she has her bone in there. She knows she has her bone, so she's just like, I want to go in there. Okay, well, I think we'll take this downstairs because the only time she ever is in there is just basically when she wants to like hide and chew on her bone. <laughs> Let's do it. I knew I was going to be doing this last night when I was going to bed, and I was thinking about climbing up on the ladder, or actually what I was imagining was like balancing between here and here without the ladder, and my stomach was in pain. The thought of me climbing up here, it like terrified me, and even right now I'm like, ugh, it's really tall. I should probably wait till Joel comes back. <laughs> my mirror, is so dusty and I can see it every time I go to take a picture. Oh. I got you. <laughs> yeah, you're holding a ladder. It's when I fall off. My ladder won't fall. Well, I'm gonna fall off the ladder. No, I'm gonna make sure the ladder doesn't fall. And if you fall, the ladder will be safe. Okay. While I'm up here. You wanna be on the vacuum to dust those? Eh, not really. I guess I don't care if they get dust. Oh, huh. Next spring, spring 2021. Spring 2021, that's this uh, grid wall's year. That's right. <laughs> that's scary. <laughs> scary. Very important job here. I have an, oh, I can like see the dust, like the brown dust. It's probably still residue from when we burned the cookies. Um, actually, you're probably very right. There's no we about that situation. I don't know why you need to single anybody out in this situation? When Joel burned the house down while I was in Hawaii. It well, wasn't Hawaii. You weren't in Hawaii. Where were you at? Wasn't I in Hawaii? I don't remember where you were at. You were in Hawaii. Somewhere. We'll link it in the description for you guys. Do you guys see the color of this? It's like yellow. There's a, It was the weirdest film on that mirror. I don't know what happened. I am pretty happy with the outcome of that mirror. So much better. It looks so much better. Yay, this has been on my to-do list for so long. I was vacuuming my rug in here and I'm just noticing like just a little few spots like this spot right here. I don't know what it is. I'm sure one of the kids brought food in here or something. Um, I'm just gonna spray that and let it sit just while I explain to you. I have used this carpet cleaner for quite a while. I get it on Amazon, fairly cheap, and it lasts me forever. I don't know what it does, but I can use it on, see like I'm not even like touching that and it's coming out. Wow, okay, so I'll link all the cleaners that I've been using, okay. I was worried that one kind of looked like, a, like an oil, like a greasy one, but it came out so good. And I don't know what these are, but I have a few of them. And the thing I like about this cleaner is that I'll let it, I won't even let it really sit, and then you just blot it up and it comes, okay, well, that feels like glue or something. <sighs> don't know what that is. Well, I don't, honestly, oh my, okay, well, that made it worse. Joel, what the heck is this? That feels like glue. Yeah, it feels like glue. That feels like nail polish or glue. That's wonderful, okay. That piece of strand will never wear out though. <laughs> so, side. Always looking at the bright side. Okay, well. Is that another one? I don't think so. What I was saying is for the most part, you don't have to let this stuff like sit and soak on the spot before it comes out. And you probably can't tell, but I'm not rubbing very hard at all. It's weird, all of a sudden in the rug, I'm noticing as it's like, as I've had it for several years, I can see black little strands. Let me see if I can find one. Like right here, if I was to dig at this and put my nail under, it's just like a loop in the carpet that is like, that's made its way to the surface so it's not dirty, it's not anything. It just has this like weird 
fiber. I was noticing the vacuum wasn't sucking up very good, so Joel's gonna clean off that. Oh my, the mm -hmm. roller. It's typically quarterly that we have to clear this thing off. <laughs> That's funny. I was gonna say, what do you clear mostly out of it? It's probably hair. Hair and then like, I don't know where these long old rug fibers come from, but they're just like falling out of <laughs> Okay, well thank you for cleaning out my vacuum. I remember my dad doing this. Really? All the time. <laughs> <laughs> That's where I learned it. Yeah. Thanks, Grandpa Helene. Do you see all these clothes? Those are clean. These are dirty. <laughs> and I think it's time for me to put all my clothes away because this is ridiculous. How many times can two go into two? Once. How many times can two go into eight? Two times can go into eight four times, which makes one four. Wait, that four. doesn't make sense. Wait a second, hold on. I asked Joel, how is a fourth plus a fourth equals a half? And so he was supposed to show us. Oh, it is. Let's, I, let's Google it. I'll show, you, I'll show you exactly why. This is how I think of it contractor style. Okay. You have a one inch increment. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. You cut it in half. One. Oh, wow. Half. You cut those in half. Well, yeah, that's like the pie system. Yeah. But just like with numbers, but how does the, that make sense? But that's the hard way. I don't think it has to be the numbers. I don't think it has to be the number system. I mean, we think. Oh, you know, no, no, This is quantitative. Oh, quanti Yes. I'm done with math in school. I want to see if Lady will do it again. Boston, grab her toy. Where's the toy that you're going to throw? Now, take Lady with you. <laughs> take Lady with you. And throw it this way, Boston. Okay, throw it over Olivia. <laughs> oh, la she launched off, she jumped on Olivia's butt, launched off it, and <laughs> <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> we just had dinner and it's not quite quite bedtime. <laughs> we've done all of our chores for the day. We did cleaning, we did homeschool, and we've done really, really good piano practicing today. Oh yeah. So we are done ah! for the day. This is a note from Boston that says love mom. Love mom to mom from Boston, love mom, Lady Cody, Boston, Olivier. <laughs> Lincoln, what's the matter? Boston didn't put my name on. Oh, who else's name wasn't on there? Daddy. <laughs> hey, Boston. Do you love Lincoln? Mhm. Mm Why don't you tell him? I love you. I love you, Lincoln. His name is hard to spell. <laughs> L-I-C-L. Lincoln! L -I -C -L Lincoln. Look at me. Lincoln, look at mom. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think he's okay.